Hi, I'm Channel 2's Chris Hernandez with an important update from the site of the East Campus Patrol Project here at 26th and Prospect. A big construction kickoff was just held and another important event that brought two groups of people face to face. The people who are looking for jobs and some of the people who are doing the hiring. When everybody uh, make sure you get a name tag, uh, contractors please list your name, uh, scope of work you'll be performing and the name of your uh, company as well as put a sticker on there so everybody knows that you're a subcontractor. For all the Section 3 workers that are here, would you please uh, grab a name tag, um, put your name on it, uh, the trade that you're interested in talking to. Um, and also we have a sign-up sheet to receive information um, about the project. I felt that it was a learning experience for them. They're young and I wanted to help them get started on their small career goal. And I did it. It was quick for me to get on. I wanted to try something different, put something different under my belt. It's, it's good to get to know people. It's, it's, it's different jobs out here, you know, from um, what to say, uh, the painters, the pipe fitters, uh, bricklayers. And so it's, it's a good thing. You know? The East Patrol Campus Project has been meeting its minority hiring goals and the project is being leveraged to spark training and employment opportunities for low-income workers in the area. Hundreds of people have received referrals to training programs that will help them qualify for future work at other construction sites as well. I visited with a lady named Gigi. She was there, so I um, got all my paperwork in and here I am today. It has been one of the city's goals from the very start to do more than just construct a couple of buildings. And by adding this extra training and helping people that way, we are well on our way to rebuilding the entire community. At 26 and Prospect for Channel 2, I'm Chris Hernandez.